Well, this is going to be a comprehensive look at my three inch leveling kit that I'm getting installed tomorrow. So um, it's going to be three inches in the front and one inch in the back. So it's actually a leveling lift kit, it's called, I believe. So I'm going to measure some stuff there and maybe back there to just see how much difference there is. Also, what I thought I might do is uh, do another uh, video on how the uh, Ranger has been for me the last 18 months. Um, well, actually it's been about 17 months, but who's counting? There are some things I like about it and some things I don't like about it. And I'll try to put those in a video. All right, I'm going to measure from the floor to the height of the blue well here. Try to get as accurate as possible. All right, so basically 35 and a half inches. Now let me move this over here. Okay. And that was for the front tire, for the front, not the rear. Okay, 37 and a quarter. Okay, so it's the next morning and uh, getting ready to go over to the place. It's called the Lift Shop. It's in Phoenix, Arizona. Hopefully they do a great job if they do. I'll let you know, and if they don't, I'll let you know. Okay, it's a beautiful day out now. It's nice and sunny. I don't, not too much wind. A little wind, not bad. Okay, so, and for some reason, the media mod is working. It's on, it's on again, off again. It quit working like two days after I could return it to Amazon? Oh well. Okay. This would be the last time I see it without the lift and bigger tires. Alrighty. Okay. Here is my Ranger now with the three inch lift and bigger tires and I moved it out but it's still windy out there but the uh, media mod for the GoPro is working I do have a little bit of a windscreen on there so hopefully it won't be too windy but you can see maybe the wind is not the wind the uh, shade might be blocking it but that's that's a lot higher in the front and uh, let's go around here and get a side view okay there's the side view and uh, the bigger tires the lift looking good alrighty then and um, here's the back. That seems a lot higher too. Getting into it, it, I definitely notice a height difference. And on one of my rumps, 
Yeah, okay. So, so there you go. That's the after and the before and after video. And uh, can't wait to take it off-roading. So, yeah. All in all, I'm pretty happy with this truck, except for the other little two things that I mentioned. So, let's do this. I'm gonna set the GoPro down here. Also, awesome. I didn't show this yet, but maybe I did. But there's the uh, the light that I put in, and I'm thinking of getting a um, winch next, because I don't want to get stuck out in the middle of the desert, especially during the summertime. All right. Thank you for subscribing and sharing and liking and commenting even though hardly anybody ever does but that's okay i'm mostly do use youtube for um entertainment a hobby you know i am retired and uh one last thing i'm gonna leave you with is like it's like what the heck am i doing with uh snowshoes in phoenix arizona and also what's this story behind these propellers all right so that's for another video stay tuned Ta -da. all right here is the new tires and lift and we're going to try to get this fairly close to being accurate so, let's see, oops, I'm going to say that's right at 39 and a quarter, 39 and a quarter, that's the uh, front one, now let's go back here, and Should back my truck out but I don't feel like it right now all right so there is make sure I can I'm in frame and pretty much all right here we go with the back one Super accurate, but fairly accurate. Okay, so I want to say that's right at thirty nine and three quarters. Okay, thirty nine and three quarters for the back. Okay. So, um, you can see the difference between no lift and the lift. So that's great. All right, time to go make a video now. <laughs>